Hey everybody, Fifth Horseman back again. Episode 2 of FTL, we're in the Basilisk. Uh, we've lost one of our Mantises, but we've gained a Rockman and an NG and a Human. So we, we got kind of lucky on the, the crew, gaining crew, but we got unlucky on losing crew. Um, we have jumped to an Uncharted Nebula, which if you've watched my series, you know that means I was forced to. <laughs> um, and we're just going to muck around in here. Sadly, the store's right there, and we don't have enough scrap to really buy anything good. So we're going to just jump around until we find out, uh, until we get out of this nebula, until we're forced to by the rebels. Um, a rebel scout seems to be waiting for us. Okay. He's got a missile. So I need the defense drone up. I don't need to dodge anything. And I don't need my shields. So let's get the teleporter up. And that's good enough. And let's send our... Oh, he's got a med bay. He's got a med bay. I don't think we can kill him. Maybe if we can take the weapons offline. Take the weapons offline so he doesn't have this missile anymore. Then I can take the defense drone offline and send it in, and then, we, then we'll have three borders and we can kill his... Uh, or you know what? I can send the human in, too. Now let's not do that. Let's not get crazy. Okay. Let's do this. Let's, let's try this strategy and see what happens. Oh shit, I need my shields. <laughs> yeah, you get up there and fix the shields. What am I why am I not doing that? Yeah, he's gonna be able to heal his guys in a constant repeated loop. Uh, maybe this guy will die. Oh, and he just got my drone. Yeah, let's uh, let's bring you guys back. Get the engines going again. Not worth it. Not worth it at all. Um. <clears throat> Sadly, oh, this would have been fun. Oh, what am I doing? I didn't bring my drone back online. Now I can't. Oh, I can still. Sorry, I'm like micromanaging this, but the situation has forced this upon me. Uh, let's take these down and bring this guy up. And take him down and bring these up. <laughs> Eventually he's going to run out of missiles. Actually, you know what? Eventually he's going to run out of missiles. And then I don't have to worry about that anymore. Then his weapons won't be a concern. You know what? I'm going to try to win this battle. Yep, I'm going to try to win this battle. He's going to run out of missiles. And when he does, he's screwed. Because he's the computer, and he's not going to be smart about... Ugh. He's not going to be smart about turning his missiles off. So as long as I don't take his uh, shields out, then I can get that boarding drone working. Okay. Here we go. Um, I don't need to dodge anymore. Boarding drone... And the three of you, let's see where the boarding drone goes. In the drone bay, perfect. Okay, oh wait, yeah. So now... Oh, you just shot my boarding drone! It's like I, I don't have enough stuff. But let's now... We can double our shields and do one on the teleporter until the drone bay gets fixed. Okay, now take a shield and the oxygen off, turn the boarding drone back on. Okay. 
And we've killed one of their crew members. Okay. Now, let's pull our guys back. And... Okay, his drones are offline. <laughs> and they will be forever now, which is cool. Okay, but now we need a, we need a shield. <laughs> this is hard. Okay. Sweet. His weapons are back off, so I can bring the boarding drone back online. Okay, you guys get back in the fight. What we're going to do is, as soon as somebody comes in here to fight us, we're going to send the two of you in there. And the two of you together can kill him. And then... <laughs> then you can the two of you together can kill him and we win. Woohoo! <laughs> A pike beam! An almost completely useless weapon. Wow, that that was totally not worth it. That was not worth the damage we took, but it was fun. We succeeded where we thought we couldn't win, which is the important thing. <laughs> okay, let's get the med bay and the teleporter offline to get that online. Yeah, see, to upgrade my weapons, I need 60, which is just crazy um, for a pike beam, which is so unlikely to help. Because the only reason I'm using weapons is for automated drones, which only very occasionally don't have uh, shields. Okay, let's get these going and the teleporter online. Why not the med bay? And let's keep going. Uh, look, lock under their life signs. Another human. Hasifa. Um, you're going on shields. Yeah, that store is kind of a possibility now. Let's see what happens here. Uh, let's put our rock crew member on the board. And they give us supplies. Sweet. Yeah, with a hundred scrap, I, and I can sell that pike beam. I can get a, I can get a good ion weapon here, um, or a rock crew member. None of those matter. I think we're gonna fix up, get the rock crew member, fuel up, and call it a day. <laughs> if we could get a fire beam, we got two rocks here. <laughs> I'm not gonna bother powering up my stuff because I'm going into this nebula here. Oh. Apparently, when there's no nothing going on, the nebula ion storm goes away magically. Okay, let's go here. Okay, what do we got? We've got a one-shot weapon. We've got that. We can take the shields down one. Get our oxygen back online. Send a boarding drone over there. See where it ends up. And send our guys into the weapons. <clears throat> yeah, I'm doing this to keep... Oh, I have a fire somewhere. I should have paid attention to where that... I'm just going to have to evacuate air from the entire ship. All right, while I do this, I should have been watching that other ship, but I'm watching the battle over here because I'm making sure I keep these guys from healing up too much before the air runs out of this room. Is it going to take out the... It did! <laughs> With seven left. You find a prisoner who joins your crew. Another human! 
Okay, you're going to round off our boarding party. What am I doing? What, what, what am I doing? Uh, let's close all of our doors. Jeez, get you guys in the med bay. Whew. That could have been disastrous. That could have been disastrous. Okay. You get down there, you get down there. This is not the boarding party I was planning on having when I started <laughs> this trip, but it's a four-man boarding party, and in almost any configuration, except for maybe two Zoltans and two Engies, a four-man boarding party is pretty damn awesome. Okay, here's an example of waiting it out. Um, I'm going to throw this boarding drone there. And then eventually win. And he landed in the perfect spot. Yeah, he can't hurt me anyway. Okay, um, this is going to take a while, so I'm going to idle. There is absolutely no reason for you to watch this. So I'm going to idle, and I will be back when uh, he is dead. Just really quick, in case you didn't see uh, the strategy, he took out that weapon, and now he has moved on to the... Um, to the cockpit and now he's moving on to the engines and because it's an automated scout it's going to slowly repair those things and the cool thing is is as soon as he takes out these engines um assuming he does them quickly enough he's going to move on to the to the cloak and while he's attacking the cloak the weapons are going to start to come back online so he can then go get the weapons again and when he destroys a system it does one hull damage so he's going to slowly just work his way back and forth across this ship destroying it. <laughs> so, uh, again, uh, I'm going back to idle, and we'll be back in a minute. One thing I forgot, notice he's moved back to the cockpit. Um, he isn't repairing his weapons, and I forgot about that. It's a, it's a interesting FTL. It's not a bug. It's a design choice by the, by the designers. Um, if there's a hull breach in a room, then um, you can't repair the system until the hull breach is repaired so he can't repair his weapon so i'm in even better shape than i was before <laughs> so uh we're just letting this go and one thing i could do um although it's kind of cheaty is i can knock my shields down and back up to give my shield guy more more experience but i'm not going to do that because um the makers have said that that is a bug and um they're they fixed it in the newest version that i haven't gotten yet so that uh, you get the experience when your shield goes down, not when it comes back up. And the boarding drone did his job. Good job, boarding drone. Um, and I got a drone part back, which is awesome, and some scrap and some fuel, which is always appreciated. So we're going to go here. I'm going to guess this might be a store. We're going to find out in a minute. Um, I think Nebulas can only have one store, but I could be wrong about that. Oh, we're attacking the smugglers. And they're Zoltans. Which is the worst. Um, he can't hurt me at least. Um, but I can't hurt him. So we're going to wait out until our, uh, until our thing comes back online. Sadly. Um, yeah, here's a, here's a situation actually where the pike beam would have come in handy. Because I could get through his shields and then go in there and, and destroy him. So maybe the pike beam is a good idea. I don't know. I, but I don't have the scrap to upgrade it right now anyway, because it takes 60, which is crazy. It's a crazy amount of scrap. Okay, we're out of here. Sorry, dude. Uh, nothing here, nothing there. So we're just going to piddle our way through this neighborhood. We're going to try to visit as many of these as we can. Okay. Oh, we need this up. Okay, he can hurt us with his, uh, that's a dual shot, and then that's a thing, so if, oh no, it's a single shot, so he can't hurt us, which is awesome. So as soon as those guys come out, uh, I think we're going to send you two up to the shields, and then you two, as soon as they come out, one of them comes out. Yeah, sadly, their mid bay is better. So we'll just destroy everything on their ship.
Oh, sweet. He went to repair the thing. Okay, now we can destroy the mid bay. Um, yeah, I can't pull my guys back. I just have to make sure. There we go. Or no. You go there. You go up there. You go down there. There we go. Yay! Prisoner who offers to join our crew, another rock man! Which is awesome. That means we can put him there. We can put Dangler in weapons. <laughs> Sorry, Dangler, you, you have a very non-fun job right now because there's no weapons to man. But when they when we do get some, you're the man for it. Um, and now we have... Yeah, God, I want a fire beam. I want two ions and a fire beam. That would be awesome. An ion Mark II, uh, an ion regular, and then a fire beam, and I could just take down the shields and then beam my three rockmen in. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's a fun ship. Um, it's eerily quiet. Great. I would rather have eerily loud with gunfire. Prepare to chase them. Ah, uh, they, they slipped away. Okay, let's go here and then leave this sector. This has been a long one. Got a couple long battles here. Um, attack the automated ship to get to the station. I can't... I, this is one of those ones... See, I can't tell what it has. It has the same loadout as before. I'm going to attack it to see what it has. And if it doesn't have anything, we'll just get out of here. And if it does, then... Okay, sweet. Boarding drone. Uh... Boarding drone. You probably remember this. Oh, and he's back in the weapons, which is awesome. That's exactly what we want. So, uh, you saw this before, so we're doing it again. Okay, we're on the last point of health. I figured you'd want to see this. <laughs> I don't know why you would, but... <laughs> uh, we're just basically just sitting here. I took the time to uh, take a bathroom break and get some more coffee. Uh, investigate the station. Fuel drone parts and scrap. Pretty awesome. Okay, let's get to the exit. Uh, let's see. Jump to the... There's nothing there. Okay, well, let's see what the next sector is. We've got a choice between the civilian sector and NG Homeworlds. Um, I have a full crew, which is pretty awesome after two sectors. Um, so I don't know which one I'm going to pick, but uh, I don't need an NG, that's for sure. I, I have one already. <laughs> so uh, find out, though, what I do next time.